My name is Vanessa Stanton, and I am your live captioner. And I have Amanda remotely captioning what I'm saying so that I can explain to you guys about captioning. <laughs> so, and it's working, yay! Say hi, Amanda. <laughs> okay, so hopefully I don't hang up on her. That would be awesome. So this is the Steno keyboard. And after what Aaron just said, I feel bad because I think it's going to be the back of my head. But um, this is what it looks like on my machine. Oh, that's great. Okay, I've never presented before, so. Um, <laughs> Thank you. So um, I didn't grab my machine to bring it up here. Um, will you grab that one on the table on the end? I brought my dinosaur one. <laughs> Perfect. It can probably just go maybe right there. Okay, so this is the um, Stenture Fusion, and it's special because it was the first machine that was paper or paperless. And so I haven't been able to let it go yet. Um, <laughs> but for the keys, um, this is what it looks like on my end. And so, um, Everything is one stroke at one time, and it's phonetic, so it's by how it sounds. And so on this side of the keyboard is the beginning of every word, and on this side is the end of every word. And so when I hear that, I do one stroke down, and it makes the word. And um, down here, which is those four keys on the bottom, those make my sounds, um, they're like the vowels, but when I hear them, I don't hear the vowels, I leave them out, and my computer-aided transcription puts it back in. And I have no idea if this is making any sense. <laughs> so, um, but I did bring this for anybody that wants to come check it out and take a look, um, because this particular one, I can still lift it up to show what's on the inside. Um, I don't know how you do that anymore on these new ones. So that, that is a nice feature. But um, with the keyboard, so that the T and the K make a D, and the T is also just a T and the K is also just a K. <laughs> um, so if I was to do cat, it would be K, A, and then the T over on this side. <laughs> Um, the P and the W make a B, or it's just a P or a W. So if I hear a word that I'm not familiar with, which can happen a lot at these kind of conferences, <laughs> <laughs> I will do my best to spell it letter by letter phonetically. And so that's why you might see some words that you know what it means, but it's not spelled right. And hopefully, because that's what I'm trying to do, <laughs> is it might not be spelled right, but hopefully you know what I was trying to to type. And so the two um, keys in the middle, those are my backspaces, which you've probably seen. So um, that lets me go back and make any corrections since it is going out um, live for everyone to see. And she's still going, hi Amanda. <laughs> she's so awesome. And so on, um, <laughs> They're cheering for you. <laughs> They're cheering for you, Amanda. That way you know it's you. It's you, Amanda. <laughs> That's so awesome. <laughs> Okay, so um, I'm going to skip over the F and the R for right now. Um, the P and the B are the N sound. So like if I wanted to do den, I would do the TK for the D, the E, and then the PB for the N all at the same time. And so that's how I'm able to do it faster than just typing on a regular keyboard. 
um, if I do the PB with the G, that would be my ING ending. And I think, I think I'm done. <laughs> I, think, I got a sign. Thank you so much, Amanda, for doing the live captioning. You're awesome. So that was your look behind the curtain for the year. Literally behind the curtain. We had a table for her set up back there and there were some AV problems. And she is literally behind the captioning screen, which I am sad about. But that's why we decided to bring her up on stage and show you there's a real human back there doing this lovely, lovely work. So once again, please give a round of applause to all the people behind the scenes. Yeah.